Hello everyone, welcome back to Coding Tricks. So, in today's session, we are going to see the next task of data analysis. So, that next task is task 20N. So, here we are going to see open the file that you saved in task 20M. So, select from all the data only the employees who are currently working on jobs per bin account. Bin account. So, here they are asking for filters. So, what about they are asking select from all the data only the employees who are working for jobs for bin account so we will open the account so see here the one who is working for bin account we want so we will hide the filter here first so we will apply the filter so after clicking here sort and filter you will get the option called filter if you click on the filter you will get the filter here so if you click here, you will get the uh, all these tasks. I will call all the names you will get. So they ask for bin only for bin account. So let us see only bin account. If you if you select here, you will get only bin account value. Bin account values. See, only you will be getting bin account. So this is the task twenty L. That means filters whatever you want. If you want the num if you want bin account and LGY, you will be getting bin account and LGY. So this is how the filters are used. Filter filter will do filtering here. That means it will uh, it will refine like like uh, which accounts, which one, which names you want. So those it will filter here. So that we will see the next task. This is task twenty N. Then task twenty O. So open the file that you saved in task 20M, select from all the data only the employees where the task code is between 3 and 6. So the whose task code is between 3 and 6. Here we are going to use custom and custom filter. So first let us clear this filter or yes let us clear this filter. So they are asking for task code 3 and 6. So we will go for custom fil custom filter. So in the filter, so after applying the filter, if you select here, it will have the number filter. So number filter. So what you want? You want if you want the custom filter, you will go for custom filter equals or which one you want according to the question you will select here. So our question is what is our question here? They are asking for only the employees where the task code is between 3 and 6. Between 3 and 6. So what they have written is greater than or equal to 3 is less than or equal to 6. We should write like this. So we will see custom filter. So is greater than or equal to 3. We will write here is greater than or equal to 3 and less than is less than or equal to okay less than or equal to 6 this is how you will write that means it will include 3 and 6 so we got 3 4 5 6 this is how you will do that means if you want to include you will be writing greater than or equal to less than or equal if you don't want to include you will be writing less than 3 or greater than 3 greater than 3 less than 6 like that so this is how you will be doing this uh, number filter okay that's all for this video thank you everyone i hope you enjoyed this video please like and share thank you